She was a young girl I met in 1995 when we won the All-Ireland. I'll never forget it. She was in her wheelchair at the side of the tunnel when I was walking out. And they had asked her who she wanted to meet, and she pointed to myself. And um, from that night, for a number of years, myself and Sheila would have been very close. She had spined a bifida, but I used to call to her house, to herself and her mum there, quite a lot. We would probably watch the same video every single day, which was, believe it or not, myself and my dad's interview after the All Ireland in 1995. She loved watching it. And um, we used to have to watch that every day. And she was an incredible young girl, but she fought. So I remember, I think it was 1997, she was given, I don't know, it was 24 hours to live or something, didn't think she'd make it, but she did. Good. And she, she got another year out of it. But, you know, I often think I helped her a lot, you know, but it's funny, I end up probably going up to her grave before most big games and I'd have a little chat and I'd ask for a bit of help going to the game. It's funny, I always feel like I have that little angel on my shoulder when, when really? I head away, yeah. She and had a huge impact on you, obviously. Massive, and, like, I, I'm looking at the job I have. I, I get to visit quite a lot of ill people that aren't feeling the best and there's times you can make them feel a bit better.